I hope that they brought some shovels to knock the grins off of our face. Everybody, welcome to another edition of His Turn, Her Turn. I would be the His Turn part of that, Paul Bryan, along with the car coach, Lauren Fix. Hello. Hello. We find ourselves in uh, uh, sunny, occupied Sacramento, California today at yes. Thunder Hill Racetrack. Yes, and this is a really cool track, so there's two tracks up this way. Hyundai has taken advantage of this particular one in uh, Smart. Sacramento to highlight their new Veloster Type N. 19-inch wheels optional, better tires from Pirelli, awesome brake pads, lots of changes, lots of aftermarket parts that you can buy and get rid right of the dealer. Put sure. them on. Yeah. And if you need more parts, go back to the dealer. A lot of fun stuff going on. I think the best thing that we can do for you, though, is to go ahead and bring you along with us for the ride. And yes. since you've got the brain bucket. you got to go get your brain bucket, and I'm going to chase you down. are comfortable in the passenger side. Yeah, I love the really thigh are. support. The and, and they're not powered. On no, side they're, they're not either here. The yeah. seats are comfy. Because mind you, these are not daily driver seats. These are racing buckets, essentially, that are have some nice padding. In them. Gosh, that exhaust still sounds nice. Yeah, it does, huh? Well, what they're doing is they're giving that burn back. You know, that bulk, that burbling is just excess gasoline in the exhaust. And so it's burning it. So it's exciting, exciting. Six-speed manual. That's the only way it comes. Yeah. No so, automatics, my no friends. Automatic. Three pedal posse. You gotta you gotta know how to do all three pedals to drive this one. Yep. You know what? This is not a drag strip car. No. -uh. It's it's not like that. So so don't be thinking about it. It's fun to do every once in a while. Just remember if you own the vehicle, don't go crazy. This car is a lot different in a lot of ways. All the details are down below as far as why it's different, how it's different, different color combinations, cool blue seat belts as you can see. Red brakes, red trim pieces, big, big difference. 275 horsepower, 19 inch optional wheels, optional brake pads. You get the uh, the Pirellis with the, with the 19 inch, the 18 inch are Michelin uh, pilots. The steering wheel's nice and beefy, it'd be nice if it was a flat bottom wheel. It's nice tight. It's a very German feeling car, thanks to Albert Bierman. Like the real gauges, I love the fact that you can do the rev matching. If you don't want to, you can shut it off. You can set your mode for, you know, eco mode if you just want to drive it every day. Center stack is 8-inch standard. Infinity Audio, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto. No wireless charging, but I don't think that makes much of a difference in this car. Pretty basic buttons, pretty basic uh, controls for the heating and cooling. Lots of plug-ins for, for chargeability. Two cup holders. I do like the third door in this car. I think it's weird if you've never driven this car. When you get in and you got packages and you're in a vehicle like this, it's tight. There's no way to get in the back seat without moving the seat forward, adjusting yeah. the seat. Yeah. You don't have to do that anymore. You just open the third door and put your stuff on the passenger side on the right. Also good for children exiting. You want them to exit on the curb side. As far as the vehicle's looks overall, I like the red details, the red brakes. I like the blue seat belts. I think they did a great job making it look performance, but not too much. This is kind of a boy racer car, but I'll tell you what. If you want to get involved in autocross or driving schools or going to an SECA track night out, this is a perfect car to learn. You don't want to 
pink, your first car on the track, a Corvette, a Camaro, a Mustang GT, you're gonna get it over your head, and it also gets very expensive. This car was designed under $28,000, entry level, with a performance pack under $30,000, so that you would get into a vehicle that you could really wrap your arms around, feel confident, and then from there, if you wanna get into racing. You could racing, wrap your checkbook around. Yeah, well, yeah, you, I mean, let me no, tell you, I started yeah. racing a Mustang. Yeah. I, I was, you know, working my carcass off just to pay for tires and brake pads. We do appreciate your subscriptions, uh, and hopefully you got involved in that giveaway. There's a link down below. We're giving away five Harman Kardon audio, um, really cool uh, wireless speakers and a headset on one. Uh, the link is there. Hey, subscribe. We appreciate it. Ring that little bell. Click that little bell, and you'll find out next time we post either the news stories of yeah. Everyone's Got a Car Story. Everyone's Got a oh, Car Story. Oh boy, does Paul have some good ones. We laugh hysterically. We we keep saying we're going to put it on tape. We're going to put it on tape. You're going to be lucky enough to see these. I have a great story that will blow your mind and that no one will ever be able to do again. i got quite a few stories. Can, we, can we tease one? Sure. Paul drives the Pope Mobile. Yeah. <laughs> You're not going to believe it. Check it out. We also have a story that, of us, what happened to us in Spain, <laughs> that might be be something that we hope never happens to anybody else. No. Uh, but th there's some really great stories. We're going to get some other of our friends like Javier Mota and Al Vasquez. You should follow them too. I want to go back on the track. They said we can spend the rest of the day on the track. Why not? Someone I'm else's ready. tires, someone else's car. Thank you so much for being with us. Take care. We'll see you next time. We are rolling. All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, buckle up. Fix this at the wheel. <laughs> I'm kind of chuckling to myself at the shift light. You should shift. I'm not shifting. Torque band, baby. Yeah. <laughs>